Hey, it's Chris, and in today's video, we're gonna talk about the different Peloton running workouts in the Peloton Digital app. So the tagline on the Peloton website for Peloton Digital is thousands of fitness classes, but with your own equipment. And that's honestly what the Peloton Digital app is. It's a way to get those Peloton classes like the Peloton Tread and the cycling classes, but using your own equipment. In today's video though, I'm gonna talk about two types of running workouts. The first is gonna be the outdoor workouts. That's what I've been doing the most of. All you need there is a phone that will run the Peloton Digital app and obviously some workout sneakers. The other type of workouts are the Tread and treadmill workouts. I'm also gonna talk about those too because I do like to do those when the weather's really hot or really cold. But right now it's great weather because I get up early and go run in the morning. So I do a lot of outdoor workouts. So it is $19.49 a month if you do not have a Peloton bike or tread subscription. Like me, I do have a Peloton bike, so I pay the $39 a month for that subscription. So the Peloton digital stuff is already included in that subscription. So I get access to all those tread Classes. Right now you can sign up and get two months free to try it out and see if you like it. The workouts are best performed on a flatter type of terrain. So I like to go to a running track sometimes for the local high school, but I've also found some pretty level running trails in my area. A type of run you can do is called a fun run. I do the fun run in my neighborhood. It is a very hilly run. So I don't necessarily follow their guidance, but I do like to listen to the music. And sometimes they'll tell stories about the song or just in general, and that's really entertaining. And I think it really makes running outside a little more enjoyable. You can pick from a variety of different workouts. There are tempo runs, there are the fun runs, there are distance, and there's even a training program now for marathon prep. So if you're wanting to run your first marathon, there is a multiple week long training program for that now. But once you picked a workout and started it, on the display on your phone, it's gonna show your length of the workout, speed, distance, heart rate if you have a heart rate monitor connected, calories burned, all of those metrics as you would expect from an outdoor running app. So a great thing about having all these metrics is it will sync to Apple Health, so get credit for all of that workout and calories burned. I use an iPhone when I run outside and I have a quad lock case and the armband that works with that case. I'm a huge fan of the quad lock system. I like the ability to have my phone out, using it, getting it set up, and then easily click it in and click it out from my arm while I'm running or at the beginning of the end of the workouts. The other type of running workouts available are the indoor running. So these are gonna be your Peloton tread workouts where you're gonna use your own treadmill or your gym's tread. They're gonna be the same instructors from the outdoor running. So you're gonna be able to pick an instructor. I like Andy Spear, he's probably my favorite. There are live workouts and a large on-demand catalog. I like doing the live workouts. There's a lot at 6 a.m. in the morning here. Sometimes I will log in and do those. I actually got a shout out from one of the instructors, even though I don't have a Peloton tread, which I thought was pretty cool. One great thing about using a treadmill is that you can use your phone or you can use an iPad or an Android tablet. A lot of times I'll forget to bring a tablet, so I will use my phone, but for longer workouts that I'm really psyched up about, I will use my iPad. The 9.7 regular iPad is perfect for this. It fits perfect on the variety of treadmills that I've used it on, and I think it is a great companion to using the Peloton Digital treadmill classes on gym or your own treadmill equipment. One thing that is missing is there's no Apple Watch support. I love the ability to load my audio only workouts, especially the outdoor ones, to the Apple Watch. That way not have to take my phone with me because phones have gotten pretty big in size and having a iPhone XS, which is the smallest iPhone you can get on my arm is a little bit annoying. Hopefully they will add Apple Watch support in the future. So that is the Peloton Digital Indoor and Outdoor Running Programs. So hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. If you wanna see more videos like this, cause I'm gonna do some more in this series, including the strength training, the yoga, meditation. If you wanna see those, then please go ahead and hit subscribe. And if you have questions or comments about the Peloton Digital app, go ahead and hit me up down in the comments below and I'll get back to you. I'll catch you guys in my next video.